Hey, what up, y'all? It's DJ NV. Now, NFL season is officially here, and I'm not sure about you, but my Sundays are starting to look exactly like this. Me and my favorite team's jersey sitting in front of the TV all day long. Babe, leave me alone. All right, now, I've partnered up with DraftKings Sportsbook, an official partner of the National Football League to bring all new customers an exciting way to put some skin in action, all right? I'm talking right now. Now, this is what you got to do. New customers, download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use my code TBC. Bet just $5 and boom, $200 in bonus bets will hit your account instantly, all right? So don't wait any longer. Download the app, DraftKings app right now and get that bread. Wake that ass up early in the morning. The Breakfast Club. Morning, everybody. It's DJ NV, Charlemagne the God, Jess Hilarious. We are The Breakfast Club, and we got a special guest in the building. That's right. Cardi B. Cardi B. Body B. Big Body. Welcome. Hey, everybody. Hey. How you feeling? You know how I'm feeling. Be honest. Be honest. <laughs> like I'm, I'm, I'm sad because I really had planned this week out and everything, and all of a sudden I wake up like, yeah, what the hell going on? Like my stomach is killing me. Like mm. bubble guts, though. Like bubble guts, like bubble guts. Nothing want to come out. Anything. Like Damn. I'm like stressed. Like cause like, what time is it? I hope by at least by twelve o'clock something come out, and I'm like, I right, like relief. But What'd like, what you I'm eat last night? That's a great question. Yeah? Not mine. I asked the wrong person. That I day. did. <laughs> ate a pizza. All right. Uh, so the cheese, you probably like those intolerant. I don't know. What, it was It was a wrong one. It, it was, I don't know. And I drank a lot of coffee yesterday, so I don't that, know. There you go. Oh, the coffee. Yeah. Oh. I don't know what's yeah. going on, but I don't deserve it. What, this. you was practicing with your whip shots? Yeah. You putting your whip shots on no, coffee? That's no, what I just, I just, I don't know. I'm just like going, just going through a lot right now, like. So what do you do at <laughs> noon if you got to poop and you out in public, body? You can't just pull up in a McDonald's and nothing? Yes, the who the why, why wouldn't I? I I I stay with wet wipes. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I stay with wet by, wet wipes and and hand sanitizer. Like I'm, I'm a mom, so you have to have that. Yes, shit. Like, that's true. Because your because your kids want to. Sh- yes. Anytime. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Unexpected. Yeah. So and also me like. That, <laughs> now, it, my, it might not be the food though, Cardi. I don't yeah. know what maybe, it is. Maybe it could be number three. And then they definitely ain't on their number three now, man. Nah. <laughs> it could be number three. After if after I go on tour, I definitely gonna want to have a baby. Like have another one. Yeah, yeah. I want to have another one. How many kids do you want? Like at least four. Four. Mm. You know, people gonna watch this interview now. They, the, throughout the whole interview, they gonna be thinking, "Damn, Cardi look like she got a shit." Probably so. No, but I, 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 it didn't want it to come out. Oh, I said like for three times, like it's like I can't. Like it's like I just want like one out or something. Nothing, nothing. What do you think will come out first, the shit or your second album? The, the they gonna start like that. Right, Jesus, gonna, wow. Christ. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Wow. Jesus Christ. My second album is gonna come out. I okay. have to. I have to. I, ha- I have to. When, when, is, when is the question what people want? This year? Next year. Next year. Okay. Next Early next year. Can we congratulate Cardi on her single? She got a single that's out today. Can we yes. congratulate her? Bongos. Bongos featuring Megan Thee Stallion. Love it. What inspired Bongos? Huh? I feel like I answered this question like a hundred times. Mm-hmm. I, I've been on a run, honey. Um, press, press, well, press. always the beat. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Like, at first, it's always like you hear the beat, and it's like, oh, I like this beat. Like, I really like this beat. It's funk, but it kind of reminds me of Dembo. Definitely so Dembo. It reminds me of Dembo, but it's really funk. Like, mm-hmm. technically, it's funk. Mm-hmm. So, um, What is Dembo? You know the Dominican Uptown, uptown Dominican music. You know? Oh, gotcha, gotcha, Like, gotcha. you know, I'll find. I'll take you where I'm oh, wow. <laughs> you, you be outside. You be outside here. Not no more. You, you, don't, you, see? you don't be outside. <laughs> Not no Come, more. You don't be outside. Mm-mm. I'll be in the house. I got to take you outside. But so that's a, that's a style of music. <laughs> yeah, it's a style okay. of music. It's a Dominican style of music. But like technically, really is funk. So, mm-hmm. But I just I just love I just love the beat. I start working on the beat. I mean, I start working on the song. Um... But there's like a lot of empty spaces. There's a lot mm. of empty spaces. I try to fill the empty spaces, like, you know, like just me rapping and rapping and rapping and rapping. Mm-hmm. And it just felt like a long ass song. Like mm-hmm. it just needed dynamic. So me and my team, like my team wanted to go like more like Latin artists. And I was like, I, f- I hear Megan. Yeah. Mm. I hear Megan. I hear Megan on mm. it. They're like, really? You don't see, like, you see this, like, like more Latin? But I'm like, right. no, I see Megan. And then, like, exactly what I was like hearing in my head, I sent her the song. Cut the cameras. 
<laughs> uh, exactly what I, I was envisioning in my head like when she like when she I got her like verse back it was mm-hmm. like you see mm-hmm. this is what I was envisioning yeah. and it just made it, sense were you, scared, well. were you scared the team up with Megan again because WAP was such a massive record mm-hmm. oh yeah of course of mm-hmm. course like that's why I haven't like I definitely but I feel like this was like good mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. um like when she sent the 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 her verse, mm-hmm. I was like, oh, I feel like this is a super like I feel like this is a good like WAP contender. Or something. Right, right, right. Yeah, you feel like too much pressure. Everybody asking you to do your second album. You put out these these verses and you and you killing these verses. You lighting these verses up, but everybody's keep saying, I love it, but where's the album? I love it, but where's the uh, album? Yes. Or you put too much pressure on yourself. Oh, uh, I do put a lot of pressure on myself. Like I really, really do. Like let me tell you something. For like. I just be feeling like I don't like nothing. I hear, I feel like I listen like, like 40 beats. Is it because everything sounds the same? Because I don't know if it's because sound everything sounds the same or every, like, it's like sometimes everything sounds the same and then like when it's too different, it's like, all right, bitch, that's too different for yeah. me. Like that is just too different. So I don't know what I be looking for. I yeah. don't know what I be looking for. I don't know what it is. Yeah. But like once like I something catch my eye, and I really like well, not my eye, bitch, my sound, my ears. <laughs> right, but even like I like it like that. They said you didn't love much. it, love it, and that became one of the biggest records Huge ever. Record. Yeah. yeah, I mean I do take risks. Like I do take risks. Um, but I don't know. It's just like a lot of pressure on a bitch. But I, I feel, I feel confident. I, I have a lot of songs. Y- y'all could come by anytime. Mm-hmm. Y'all can hear some. Cause, mm-hmm. And that's another thing, too. Like, I'm a Libra. I, I, I be feeling like I need, like, everybody's, like, opinion. Like, what you think? Yeah. What you think? What you think? And that kind of be driving me crazy, too. But, like, I don't know why I be, ne- I be needing it, though. So yeah. what, what, what was the mentality when you was making, like, Gangsta Bitch 1 and 2 back in the day? Like, what do you think changed now? Just success? I mean, there wasn't no mentality. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, it, it, just, it just wasn't no mentality. It was just, like, me, like saying what I want to do and everything but like I don't know like I don't know is it because I'm older or I don't know is it because like expectation expectations mm-hmm. I don't know like it's just like this is like a yeah. a job to me now like it's mm-hmm. like and and I just I just don't like nothing yeah, yeah. is it fun is it still fun it, it when I find like something that I like when it's something that I like is fun mm-hmm but and then but then sometimes even when I like something and like people don't like it, it doesn't become fun. Like it's like, damn, I was really vibing with this shit. And mm-hmm. it's like y'all don't like it now, now it's not fun. Now I'm mad. Yeah. So mm-hmm. But people don't like every it's like they're gonna find something wrong with Absolutely. whatever. Mm-hmm. So it don't matter. But it just gotta make sense to you. Let me ask you this. Is it pressure being cause it's a lot of women in rap right now. Mm-hmm. It's the versus when you first came out. Yeah. Um it's a lot of women. Is it pressure also on you to to drop music more you know like he because he asked pressure about you know what you like and you know is it more pressure because it's so many more women now like i don't really drop in here and all the time like but it's a lot of y'all now which yeah. is great but for y'all it's like okay we got this we got this we get is that pressure it being so many women in rap now no, no, not really. Great. Like to to me, not really because it's like I have my own sound. Yeah. And like it's like I cannot sound like somebody else. Like it's yeah. like I'm never gonna do day type of music because that's mm-hmm. just not my sound. Like even when like like for example, right? Like it's like I I do I do sometimes drill music. Like yeah. I I could mm-hmm. I could go to that, but it's like that's not really me. So it's like I'm not gonna feel pressure. Like it's like oh, talk to the mic, Cardi. I know your stomach hurting, but you just <laughs> talk to him. <laughs> you got to lean in. <laughs> sorry, sorry, my bad. Sorry. No, it's just it's <clears throat> it's not it's it's not really pr- like it's not pressure like the girls. It's pressure like it, the expectations are on me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So that's just how I, I got feel you. for me. I always felt though. I I always felt like this is the thing though, right? I always worked around a lot of bitches. Like even yeah. in the strip club, right? Mm-hmm. There's all type of flavor ass bitches. Like it's like, mm-hmm. and and there was a point. There was a point when I was a stripper that I only had titties and no ass. But I just know that I was like unique. Oh, like I just shit. know I was like a unique ass bitch. So it's like there's bitches that they 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 they, they thick, they they skinny, they got big titties. They they some bitches is Amazon, some bitches is shorter, and it's like mm. I just know I'm I just know I'm I'm that. So it's yeah. like I was gonna get money regardless. So I don't give a fuck. Right. How yeah. many bitches is in this bitch, bitch? I'm gonna get something. That's and that's just how I feel like. That's how I feel like now. Like I I'm so used to like working with like a lot of women. Like. Mm-hmm. 
I, I never like been like in an environment that's like yeah I'm kind of like the only one so th- and and I always I always knew this I always knew this I always knew that after me there was gonna be more girls yeah I know it was gonna I wasn't gonna I know it wasn't gonna like just end with me mm-hmm. because it's like if I make it if I made it mm-hmm. I know there's gonna be more bitches that's gonna make it and like right. the internet and everything yeah. like it's like mm-hmm. I this this I already I already I already saw this like I yeah. saw this like back in like I don't know like 2017 I saw this. But mm-hmm. you do but you also doing something that a lot of people didn't do when you were coming up. You'll find the hot new person or a young artist and you'll give them the opportunity and give them a verse. Yeah, which a lot of people didn't do. And I was gonna yeah, ask that was something that J- Jay and Drake did great. And yeah, I think yeah. I say Cardi did that for female rap. Yeah, yeah absolutely. And I was gonna ask. Does the competition fuel you? And and it can be friendly competition. I mean, every time you get on a verse or you get on a record with somebody, is is that the way you think? Like, oh, I gotta eat her. You know what I mean? Um, Pause. God damn. Yo, I, I don't. Like, I don't. Even, I don't really feel like be. I gotta eat. I don't really like feel like I gotta like eat. Like, all right. Like for example, right? Like it's like if I have a song, right? Mm-hmm. And like if I have a song, and then like you send me your verse and like you rapping your ass off. I'm still not changing my verse. <laughs> right. I'm not changing it because I feel like they're like this. This is what I'm going for. This is what I'm thinking. However, I don't want to like also never like ruin nobody else mm. like song or anything. But people so. do it all the time. We've heard, you know, I think Nas said he changed the verse when, when he got a verse back and you hear it all the time. Yeah. So you never said, nah, I got it. Make sure I'm because I'm, it's competition. It's friendly competition. Ain't no, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I, I don't know. I Because you've been going crazy recently. The last six records you put out you've been going like somebody was mm-hmm. was which one's your was favorite playing with you like who's been your favorite female rapper to collaborate with um, i really like like them all mm-hmm. i really i really yeah. i really like them all and every song that i like i got like on like i got on it because i just really 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 like that song like i love the song and it's like i feel like i could hear myself on, mm-hmm. on it there's a lot of there's a lot of songs like I get songs sent to me all the time, but yeah. I feel like it's like some songs. I just feel like I feel like I can't do nothing for the song. Like it's mm-hmm. like I don't feel like I I could do like a, a verse that like I'm like um confident in. Mm-hmm. So it's just like and I just be like no, and it's like I feel like the song is great, so I don't even want to like yeah like ruin that, it. Mm-hmm. You just say you you drill drill ain't your style. What's that? Hey, nah, what's that one song that she got? With Nod, it's the girl she go last, okay. and I told you. Oh, the Fendi point, point me too. Sure. Oh my God, that song mm-hmm. is so crazy. I I heard. Yeah. That song is so crazy. I was like, and that's my that's my style. That's my tempo. Cause some tempos like I just cannot keep up. Like right. Like it's like you know like when I first heard Munch and everything. Yeah. I love the song. Mm-hmm. I love the beat and everything. Mm-hmm. And then I was I was gonna um I I was like you know like doing the remix and everything. They said you did a verse, right? Yeah, I did a verse, yeah. but it's like. I felt like I, I felt like I was fighting the fucking beat. Like, gotcha. <laughs> mm-hmm. bitch, I can't breathe. I'm well mended. Like the beat yeah. was just, the yeah. beat just was thin. I was like, listen, I don't want to fuck yeah. up the song. Yeah, cause you gotta, gotta eat on much. Yes, like, cause so. I gotta eat. You gotta eat on much. <laughs> like, yo, <laughs> like, <laughs> yo <laughs> relax. Stupid. I get it. Stupid. I get it. Stupid. But like, I was windmilling, and it's like, if I can't keep up with something, like, it's like yeah. I'm not gonna play myself, and I don't want to like ruin it. Like, you know, like when mm-hmm. somebody get on a song, and it's like. And bitch, you really fucked this song yeah. up. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Get that bitch out of here yeah. now. Right. I like how you fucked up uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Kill tomorrow. Yeah. Oh yeah. I Y'all yeah, was I love too that in song. pocket. I love that. It was crazy. And, and I tomorrow. love. Yeah. I love. Um, Glorilla. Glorilla. I love Glorilla. She reminds me of my best friend. Like. Yeah. I I love her. Yeah. I love her. I feel like. She cool. Yeah. I feel like I, I feel like a girl. Do you think yeah. that the the label makes you do records that you may not necessarily want to do? Nobody can make me do shit. Okay. People can give me rec- like recomm- like recommendations and everything, mm-hmm. but it's like nobody can make me like do anything. I would try something. Mm-hmm. Like I would try something, and and when I say like I would try something, it's like when they want me to like to like you know be a little bit more like, you know like more feminine or more mm-hmm. like I don't know like mainstream type of stuff because like that's oh, yeah. just not really be my vibe like that. But like nobody can make me do shit. Mm-hmm. I was gonna ask you. You know you mentioned when you're working in a strip club, do people look at you as the old Cardi all the time? Because you got so many friends and you were so many people before the huge rap success. Do, sometimes you got to check somebody and be like, look, I'm not that old bitch from back then. I'm yeah. not that same person. Uh, I feel like, I feel like, uh, like, like, the people that know me know that I haven't really changed. Like, like I feel like I could call my friends right now and like, girl, bye. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I feel like I haven't like really changed like that way. But I feel like to the world, 
I feel like to the world, like I wonder if people have seen that change. I feel like I changed. I'm like more like chill now. Mm -hmm. Like I could, like back then, I could be all yeah, day cussing yeah. everybody mm -hmm. out. But it's like I just have like backed away more. And I got kids and shit. And, I, and I'm 30. Like, yeah. I'm 30. Like, by 5 o'clock, I need a little nap. That's one thing. <laughs> that's one thing I say that it looks like you love. It's like, you know, you see so many people with, with, with their kids, right? But you are like a, a mom's mom, right? Mm -hmm. I see Cardi at the amusement park with the kids getting on mm -hmm. rides. I see Cardi making the kids lunch. I see Cardi, you know, doing things that you usually don't see people do. Why are you so like that with your kids? Because, I mean... You're rich. You 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 got help. You you got yeah. people that can do that, but you do it. Cause like it's like you just have to you. Listen, you can have a, a village in your house, right? Like cause like, I have all the Dominicans in my house, right? <laughs> I got I got them all, but it's like your kids be wanting you. Mm -hmm. They want you. They don't want they don't want your aunt to take them to school. They don't want yeah. nothing. They want mom and dad to take them to school. They want like they want to chill with mom and dad. They want to play with mom and dad. Mm -hmm. So it's just like you have to do it yourself. And then like like you just have to do it. Like you gotta like get used to a rhythm. Like like it's like my family. A lot of them live with me, but they love to be outside. Mm -hmm. So when they do vacation and everything, and it's like I'm by myself with the kids, that it's like, Peace, damn, man. I don't really know like what they're gonna want to eat and everything. So I gotta I gotta get used to that. Like, yeah. it's like and I I really just naturally like it. Like I I mm -hmm. like this. If if mm -hmm. I could just do this all forever, I would. But I got a bitch got to work. <laughs> is, is that you think that's the biggest change that has happened in your life over the last five years? The kids? Hell yeah. Okay. Mm. Hell yeah. Just mo motherhood period. Yeah, cause it's yeah. like I be feeling like like I got a lot to lose before. Like fuck yeah, I'm fuck I'm I'm diving in. I lose every all. Yeah. I lose it all, but I'm gonna curse you out, bitch. So how is it? <laughs> how is it being a boss with everybody, but then when your kids? They boss you around. I seen some video and your kids was talking to you crazy. There's nothing you can do when your kids talk to you crazy. You just got to take it. I know. <laughs> <laughs> your mouth. You believe in pop popping the kids? Huh? Or no? You believe in physical discipline for your kids? Light though. Light. Real light. Light. You know what I'm saying? But like not like. Gentle parenting sometimes. Gentle parenting, I, I mean, I mean, it depends because I feel like, like, I feel like I'm a gentle parent, but then there's that, you know, the Hellman's gentle parent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hellman's <laughs> gentle parent. And they like they overboard like gentle yeah. parenting. Yeah. Some kids just, just some. I, I just believe they're like, you don't have to be like a, a, a abusive or anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it's like you, you gotta like be assertive because like, mm -hmm. like not everybody kid is like everybody kid. Like, yeah. like my son bad as fuck. <laughs> I got proof. He bad. I yeah. got proof. I got proof. He bad. <laughs> How old is he? He he just turned two. Yeah, he don't know no better. What? I show you videos. You know he bad is. as hell. Yeah. He bad. Even also be like, damn, I don't want my kids. Yeah. And he I won. knew it too. That's why I was scared to have a boy because I was like, I, I knew it too. Mm. I knew it. Too. It could be terrible twos though. Yeah. He was one. He just turned two. <laughs> How you bad at one? So what do you do to discipline him? Like, what are you afraid of? He's not afraid of nothing. Damn, there's That's nothing you the can problem. take from him or Please. take his tablet or something, nothing? No, he don't care about nothing. Damn. Like, even if you take it, it's like, all right, mm. no message today then. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> now, why, why do you let the comments get to you so much, Barty? Just on social media and just like everything. I don't know, because it's like, Bitch, I know you're not fucking talking. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. That, like, the shit that get me mad is that, like, because it's like, bitch, why are you talking, mm -hmm. though? Mm -hmm. Like, what are you, wh why are you talking? Yeah. Why are you talking? Like, it's like, like, it's like, like, it's like, you know, like, I don't know, like, when I was, like, in, like, in school and everything, like, mm -hmm. I used to cut ass. Like, I used to, I, I used to used be, to like, fight. really... No, 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 nah, no, like cut ass. Like I used to like really roast, roast, okay, roast. Yeah. like I like like mm. it's like it's not even like roasting bitches. It was like we I could go toe to toe with 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 a, with, a, with, a, with like dudes and stuff. Like it was yeah. the thing. So it's like me, like I'm the type of person that is like I could like take one look, one look at you, yeah. and it's like I could I got like ten jokes lined the fuck up. Word. So it's just like when people mess with me, it's like yo, I could really really mess with you. Want to mess my day up, bitch? I will mess your fucking whole three weeks up. I will I will I will stay in better than your head. So it's mm. just like, but it's like the fact that I have to restrain myself, it frustrates me. Mm -hmm. It really yeah. frustrates me. So when you put out projects, right? When you put out r music, do you go through the comments to see what people are saying? Yeah, yeah, Damn, yeah, music. yeah. Because sometimes it's like, bitch. No, well, you got to also know what people like, though. But they're never going to give you a real critique, though. Because they're just mad that you body and you super successful. Yeah, you're so right. how many people going to really be like, oh, <laughs> I fucked right. with this record? How many people going to really give it up on social media? 
Yeah, you know what? I be feeling, I be feeling like a lot of people hate to admit that they like me. Mm-hmm. And like a lot of people are mm-hmm. afraid to say that they like me because when people say that they like me, they get attacked. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They be getting attacked yeah. when they say that mm-hmm. they like me or they like they take my side or anything. Mm-hmm. So I have to accept that. They're like, yeah. people like like me. And there's even people that like, I've seen common nasty shit about me. And like, uh, some of my friends have pressed them about them. Mm-hmm. Like, like when they say, like, why, why you be going so hard on my girl? And it's like, I don't know. I really do like it though. Like, like, like I, I just feel like. I hate that. And it's like, mm-hmm. bitch. I hate that. Why do you have to go that route for it? Yeah. You really like Like, it. matter of fact, I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you, I'm going <clears> to <throat> give you an example, right? Mm-hmm. There's some, there's a, there's a, there's a bitch, right? I don't even fucking know her, but one of my friends know her. And it's like, yo, why this girl got so much issues with you? And I'm like, I don't even, I don't even know this girl. We don't, we're not even from the same city. Mm. She got so much shit to say about me, but she always copying my birthday looks. <laughs> <laughs> she got money to do that? For real? Oh, so it must be somebody we know. I mean, she does the Sheen version, but it's like, <laughs> the, Sheen version. Uh, the Sheen version. <laughs> How you like me? Hey, you, you like, know. like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like a lot of people be It's a haters or confused admirers. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. I just don't want that to affect, to affect <clears throat> you and your art. You know what yeah. I mean? Or your mental. I feel like I'm I'm already like getting over that hurdle. Yeah. As long yeah. as motherfuckers don't lie on me, like. Mm-hmm. That's the internet okay. though. They're going to mm-hmm. do that too. It's all right. Yeah. Like as long as people don't lie on me, like it's okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I do notice too. I do notice too because I saw, like I seen people admit it. I seen I seen trolls admit that they like to throw people into suicide. I there was Damn. a I seen it. Mm-hmm. I seen it on Twitter. Mm-hmm. Like my fans know which one I'm what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. Like I seen trolls admit that like like it's like yeah we're gonna get that bitch into she wanna kill herself. They really Damn. do that. So it's this like nah weird. bitch you ain't gonna get that power over me bitch. Mm-hmm. You gonna have to die first bitch. Not you miserable. die first hope. Jesus. How miserable you gotta be to think like that? But there's a yeah. lot of miserable people out there. Oh, that mm-hmm. mercy. Now, do you regret throwing that microphone at that young lady? It was really like a quick reaction. Mm-hmm. It was really like, and let me tell you, motherfucker, I didn't want to address it because I thought a bitch was gonna go to jail. But I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really, not nah, because motherfuckers, people was making their own shit. Like, let me tell you something, right? It was hot as fuck. That Vegas, he ain't over. And she was hot. It was higher than a motherfucker. So there was a part of the show that I told people, like, you know, you splash me. Yeah. But even when I told him splash me, I was like, be careful with the face. The, the mm. face is beat, bitch. So fucking four songs after, n- nobody has splashed me. I told y'all to splash me for one little second. Mm. Four songs after, which is like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes after, this bitch threw water and ice I, on my yeah. face. Mm. So, nice. so like, it, I just automatically reacted. reacted. I didn't even know that I was throwing it. At the, the, I just threw the shit because it's yeah. like, bitch, yeah. you hit me right in my face. Mm. And, and and when I look at the video, it's like, nah, you intend, you yeah. intended to throw that shit in my face because you ain't did it like this. You threw you it like, away like it was like, like and that ha- shit had <laughs> ice. And everybody's like, oh, but Kenny, you just have to No, bitch. You, you fucking throw some ice in your motherfucking face, bitch. And you mm-hmm. gonna tell me how the fuck you feel, bitch. Because I felt very yeah. violated. Yeah. Did you forget you had told people to splash you? No, but it was but it was it was it was in a segment though. Mm-hmm. It was in one segment. Like girl, you That's did that right. shit like fucking 20 minutes later, bitch. Mm-hmm. And not only mm-hmm. that, you threw me fucking ice, bitch. Like, don't yeah. fucking motherfucker me. If it, <laughs> nah, cut yourself. If it if it wasn't ice in it, it would have went different. It would it would no, it, it, no, it, it probably wouldn't even face. be different because mm-hmm. you splashed me just, in my face. Mm-hmm. Like you know what you was doing. How the fuck? How the fuck? Ten people splashed me at the same time and nothing hit my face. But bitch, you 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 hit mm-hmm. my face directly, bitch. One of them. I think and she was a fan though. No, no, then well, you wasn't a. You, no, you was trying to be, be funny, fan. bitch. Yeah. You was trying to be funny, but ha ha ha, bitch, I'm hilarious though. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you know so well first of all how was marriage <laughs> how was that how are you loving marriage yeah. I love love it yeah I love marriage is it, yeah. is it difficult because you know he's a celebrity and you're a celebrity and it's like when he defends you it's bigger because he is a celebrity so if somebody yeah. says something he, and he defends you it's, it's bigger because it's, it's set you know what I mean does that bother you does that take a toll on your marriage relationship you know what takes a toll on me what takes a toll on me really is because, like, a lot of people, like, like people don't fucking, a lot of people don't fucking like me. 
So when people attack him because he's like attached to me, I don't like that shit. Like it's mm-hmm. just like I be feeling like it's like oh my gosh. But um, other than that, like I love being married and like we we are a partnership. Like you know, y'all y'all you know what it is like to be married and everything. It's just like it it feels different. Like it just yeah. it feels different than like a relationship. It mm-hmm. just really feel like a, a union. And yeah. it's like I got your back, you got my back, mm-hmm. no matter what. No matter the bullshit. Do y'all feel like y'all share too much? Because y'all are beef, and then the world yeah, like, hate, social hate, media. hate yeah. both of y'all. And then a day later, y'all back together holding hands. <laughs> <laughs> that's only because it goes to social media. Right, yeah, right. That's that's right. That's Do you feel like y'all share too much on social media? It was just one time. It was just that one time. That was crazy. Th- that, that was crazy. It was just one time because motherfuckers was, was, was gone. We was mm-hmm. dr- Drunk popping shit like yeah. I bitch, ah you 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 gonna do that? I ah, do that. Oh no, bitch, I'm gonna beat you to it. Oh shit, you really did beat me to it, bitch. You see, now you're stupid, bitch. Now I'm gonna really violate you. So hold on, he said that to oh, you. He's like, I'm gonna get online and tell people you, you had sex with me. somebody, yeah. cheated on me. And I'm and I don't understand why he even said that. He know he was. It had to right. come from someplace. Did it come from somewhere? Did she just tell you where it came from? So y'all just arguing. You they was just arguing. And they was just arguing. So you told him that, and you was playing. What? I never him? told him that. Oh, okay. I never told him that. So why never. you do that? What would y'all drink? So I don't never drink that shit. You don't he, drink I'm, anyway. I'm a Henny girl. He's a Casamigo guy. Oh, uh, mm. okay, okay, okay. But we was just, we was just, it was just heated. And then mm. you, and then you explained it. <laughs> Cardi goes, "How could I cheat? I can never go anywhere with anybody." You, you didn't. Y'all explained <laughs> it. And then the next <laughs> day, y'all in Paris holding hands at a fashion show. I'm like, funny as shit. I'm like, this is the Bronx. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Bronx love. We ghetto. We really, really ghetto. I ain't gonna front. Like everybody just be like, oh, like if we be trying to be perfect, I ain't gonna front. Like we ghetto. Mm. <laughs> Do you always want to be married, young? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I always wanted. I always wanted to be married. Like mm-hmm. I always want to be married. Who? I always felt like everybody. Everybody want like the marriage and the kids yeah. and everything. I mm-hmm. just really can't believe I got it. Yeah. I feel. I, I feel like there's a number for Cardi. If Cardi get a certain amount of money, she walking away from all this shit. No. You don't think so? For music? Okay. No, no. Like I feel like music is just like the the engine. Like I I just mm-hmm. love it. Like I feel mm-hmm. like I feel like uh, like if I have like a, a product and it like mm-hmm. makes me like like rich and everything or like crazy like I mean I'm really rich. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm about rich, rich, rich and everything. Like it's just like I I enjoy though like doing music. Like I enjoy performing for real. Like I love to perform. Mm-hmm. Like I like mm-hmm. a bitch was a stripper. Like I just love to be out there. Mm-hmm. Uh like I get like a rush. But it's and it's like you can't perform if you don't really have music. So I have to always do music. I love I I love doing music. It's just sometimes it's just like this like feels like a job now. So it's just like and so much pressure just drive you crazy. I just wanna I I I'm, I wanna be in that state where I was like in 2016, 2017, no, 2018 where it was just like ah right. yeah. Excitement. Yeah. What, what made you walk away from that movie that you were supposed to star in? The music, the album, the this, really? the that, yeah. And it was just too, like, oh my God, I did not, like, doing, like, movies and everything. Yeah. It's really, like, a 10 a.m. to, like, 1 a.m. type of yes. shit. Yes, Cardi. Yep. Yes. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. So it's, like, it's really, like, a job, like, mm-hmm. a job, job, mm-hmm. job, like, like, like when I do music and like when I perform, like it's like a rush. Like yeah. it's like a fun rush. Like this is really like, I know it's intense. It hurry up intense. and wait. That's what they say. Hurry yeah, up, hurry up and wait. wait. Exactly like, but it's all it. worth it when the film come out and you see, you know, you see yourself and shit. It is worth it. It's like worth it, it. it is, but shit. And like, the, yeah. Um, you know, like I, I was like, you know, taking acting lessons and everything. Like it's like I had one struggle. It when it was to cry. Like my teacher was like, like my teacher was like, think of the time like that you went through this, this, and that. I'm like, I don't feel nothing. I don't feel anything. When's the last time you cried for real? Yeah, in real life. I mean, I, I be crying. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. I be crying, but it's just like, um, like on the spot, like, like on the spot, to like to... it's like, like on the yeah. spot, like I'm a laugh. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, I, but I always thought TV and film was that that was a, a, a given for you. Like I always yeah. saw you in that in that space. I'm good at being myself. Mm-hmm. Like I like yeah. I, I'm good at being myself. You know what I'm saying? But like it's like like huh? why you did this to me? <laughs> <laughs> yes. All you gotta do is not you laugh. Start laughing. You start you know, laughing. Like, there you go. <laughs> All you gotta do is not laugh. It's you hard, but it's like I'm, I'm gonna get it. I, mm-hmm. I gotta get it. Yeah. Yeah. So you're not gonna do it. You're not gonna do that. Movie I am at all. gonna do it as soon okay. as soon as I go uh, touring and everything and all that mm-hmm. stuff. 
You know, get I back to it. Oh, uh, Lord. Four yeah. years from now. No, I, no, I swear to God, it's not going to be four years. <laughs> it's been five since invasion. I know. Of she said I next swear, year. I, I have no choice. I have no choice. I, I like choice. it, though. I, I, I don't think you should rush to put out another album. I think you did it right, putting out the singles, the features. I, I know the label might tell you. Yeah, but, 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 but it's not even about singles? rushing. I do really, I really, 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 really do have a body of work. Mm-hmm. How many, though? Mm-hmm. I have a lot. I got like a lot of songs. I just like got to go through all of them. Do you have the name for the album yet? No. Kind of, sort of. Yeah. Kind of, sort of. I don't know. Like, I don't know if I like it too much. What is it? Yeah, tell us. I can't. Well, I can't tell you because imagine She's if I pick such it. A fucking <laughs> critic. If I pick it, throw it out there. Oh no, you can't. You can't just throw it out there. Let me see if we like it. Throw it out there. <laughs> we'll bleep it. We'll bleep it. All right. Huh? We'll bleep it. No, I can't say. It. I was gonna say don't believe right, it. I was say don't believe him, Cardi. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. How does, how does Cardi feel about this the, the state of female rap overall? Because everybody said this has been the year of women rappers. Yeah. I feel like I been knew that this was gonna happen. I mm. been knew that this was gonna happen. Like, it was. It, I been knew it. Mm-hmm. Raven Baxter, the nigga. Just... I been. I been. I been knew it. Like it's like I. I like like we live in the world of the internet. Like it's easier like to to get like discovered, and um. I already knew that this was gonna happen. Mm-hmm. What do you think about guys when they say like you know you heard Fab and JD like JD I think said it was it was stripper rap, and Fab said all the women are rapping about the same thing, which is sex and stuff like that. What do you think about those type of criticisms? I already don't be liking that shit because it's like when like let me tell you something when we rap about something else like motherfuckers just don't really want to hear it like that mm-hmm. like they do want to hear it but it's like and it's like that's what I want to talk about like mm-hmm. I don't care you're not like like um. You know, that fucked me up one time. Mm-hmm. That really fucked me up one time. Mm-hmm. I ain't gonna lie to y'all because everybody was like trying to make me feel that, you know, motherfuckers try to trick me out my game. Yeah. And that's mm-hmm. what they do. They like to trick you out your game. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like, it's mm-hmm. like, oh, we want to, uh, you, are we so tired of you uh, talking about the same subject? You you keep doing this type of music, that type of music. So then I put a certain type of music out, a certain type of sound, and motherfuckers didn't even like it. So I'm like, and then after what record was that? That yeah, was the Kanye one? record. It was it was it was hot shit, and it was like a track song that I had um, for a movie, mm-hmm. and even like the song for DJ Khaled. Like people was fucking flaming my Who ass like for that? it, huh? Who the fuck ain't like hot shit? A lot of people. Well, well, a lot of people. Like I, I was I was surprised because I did like them myself, and it's like. This is what I'm saying. Like it's like people be trying to like but, like take you out your game, mm-hmm. and then they start doing what you do, and then it's yeah. like ah, ah, yeah. ah, 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 and it's like you mm-hmm. see, no fuck that, fuck. Right. I'm gonna do what I want. Like mm-hmm. you just have to do what you want. Yeah. You know, I, I, I was gonna ask. Mm-hmm. You know, we mm-hmm. seen Offset and Quavo come back together on BT. Beautiful mm-hmm. moment. Mm-hmm. Before that, we seen a video of them arguing. You was in the middle saying, "Y'all brothers, y'all yeah. brothers, I need to stop." How um how difficult was that in the household trying to get them to understand that they're brothers? Because you were in the middle of that, you know, and you weren't taking sides during that argument. You were just screaming, yo, y'all are brothers. Get it together. Mm-hmm. How difficult that was that for your household and for you? I just I just really like to stay away from like nigga business. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, especially when like um y'all have like like really, really long history. Not just music history. Like y'all, y'all know each other like your whole life. So it's just mm. like I always just like to like step back. I always want like unity. Always, 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 all the time. Yeah. So I just didn't. I ain't really wanting to see that. I'm, I'm, I'm really like a Migos fan. Mm-hmm. Like I'm really a, a Migos fan. I'm like a fan of them for real. Like yeah. I'm a fan of everything of them. So um and like they. You know, like when, like when people, like, like people inspire you, but mm-hmm. like in 2017, when I started, like, you know, fucking around mm-hmm. with Offset and everything, mm-hmm. they really like in- inspired me more because there was like things that I never seen. Like I, f- I felt like I was like, like, like when I was like in 2017, I just felt like it's like damn, a lot of people have turned me down, labels have like shut my shit down, mm-hmm. but it's like it's cool. Like the music that I'm doing is, I, I- I'm doing alright. I'm getting paid twenty thousand dollars to to perform like I'm I'm doing this when I started dating Offset and I see that they're like performing <clears throat> in arenas and mm-hmm. I'm seeing that they're getting not fucking 20,000 they're getting hundreds of mm-hmm. thousand dollars and they buying jewelry every day and it's like no I was trying like to be 
like in a, evolve, in, 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 a, yeah. in a good space yeah. that does not even so they like inspire me mm-hmm. and like a lot of they swag like inspire me too so yeah. i'm just like a fan of, of 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 all of it so i always feel like as a woman you need to stay out of like man business mm-hmm. all the time like just mm-hmm. stay away from me you yeah. didn't stay out of it that night though Practically, I did. When you was telling them, you your your brothers, sound like your brothers, like, no, wrong. Yeah, I just didn't want. I just wrong. Wrong. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you were just like. Now I just stay away from this shit yeah. all the time. Were like, they actually tussling? Oh, it was just like some words. Yeah, they was just just talking. They was just talking. Talking. Yeah. <laughs> how, how, how did you help uh, offset through the grieving process? Are you still helping them through it? It's this hard. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't want to talk about. That. I can understand. Yeah, yeah I, I get understand. it. I get it. I don't know why you went there. You just brought everything down. Yeah, we're like, talking about shit. it, man. Yeah. Damn. Damn, hella sad. Jesus Christ, we're talking about it. Damn. What's next for Miss Body? Everything. Mm. I'm, I'm, I'm back. I'm back to work. We don't believe you. I swear to God, you know, you know had so many big records that hit number one, and we thought this album was coming. Yeah, but uh, oh my gosh, like we went through like a whole pandemic. Like, give me a break. You dropped the number one record during the pandemic. (laughs) Easily. And you had mad time during the pandemic. All right. You had time. I I really didn't want to drop an album around the pandemic because I really wanted to tour right after. Okay. I wasn't able to tour right after um my first album. Like I I could Mm -hmm. even do a lot of music videos because I was like pregnant and everything. Like I want to like drop my album and be able to go touring right away mm. so that that was that then i had a baby then i just like was just going through like a, you know i was just yeah chilling but now it's just like i'm, I'm back outside mm. <laughs> and you got an album dropping next year yeah what quarter body <laughs> what quarter I, I, what season i'm really okay, looking for season. first quarter you think so mm-hmm. how you gonna narrow it down how many records you think you got i want to narrow it down to at least like 18 20. Okay. No. Okay. Spring summer. Are you are you are you there? Are you close? Hey yo, are shut up. <laughs> He'll say spring summer. You don't oh, have to drop spring. a second album though. Is it I, you don't have to put out an album. But I have she it. Wants to go on tour. She I have it. She do. I it's have tour. it. Mm-hmm. I have it. You don't believe her? I mean I believe she got a song. I believe she got a bunch of songs. Yeah. No, I but I have it though. I have it. You have the I album. Have it. Yeah. I have I have my vision and everything. You know what you wanted. I want I know what I want, everything. Okay. Cardi, your fashion. You we not getting a line. Your fashion is crazy. You just said bitches be copying you when they be they be trying shit on you, then copy you. You gotta give them something to buy. I, I'm gonna give them I'm gonna give them a little sign sign. Uh, a little sign, sign. You had a, a line at one sign. time, right? Huh? You had a line with uh <clears throat> No, it was it was like I a thought collab. fashion over was yours for Ooh. one second. Oh, here it come. Oh shit. God damn, I heard it too. No, you didn't. <laughs> I heard it. Yeah. I think the camera picked it up, Farty. <laughs> They're going to be calling you Farty. Farty. <laughs> Farty. Stupid. Yo. <laughs> Man, get Cardi out of here before she have an accident. Oh, God. Whip shot is over. Oh, nah, whip shot. shot. <laughs> Got it. Like, the bitches hit me. Uh, yeah, you saw You're drinking coffee like the whole interview. <laughs> no, there's not. That's ginger ale. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, no coffee. Oh she said God. she drank coffee Damn. yesterday. We got bathrooms in here. <laughs> you, your eyes watering. In the interview, she man, she, she just got said a whip shots. She wanted to oh, talk about the whip shots. The whip shots is up here. That's the last thing. I want to know if we was getting a, a clothing line because her, her fashion, she stay on point with the fashion. But anyway, whip shots. I love how it was no dairy. I love how it was vodka. Yo, she got to go. Get the lights on. I love how it's, on. yeah, she no, like, you're house house. <laughs> nah, like, yeah, it's, I, it's, I it's love... not, like, it's not playing, it's not playing, like, it's like, it's like, not there. It's like still here. I need it like to you go. You know, like, women always here. say they're false uh, those things. That's a goddamn lie. Who the fuck? Well, I, I ain't the woman that said that. Oh, okay. But no, I'm not even. <laughs> but that's not. That's not the thing. I'm not even gassy. It's just like really like hurting. Like it's just hurting. Like it's like Ooh. developing. It's like making itself. Yeah. It's, it's not. Developing? It's not. Yeah. It's like developing. It develops. <laughs> it develops a baby. I'm gonna give you this juice. It's drink. like it's making itself. Like the bitch is becoming a smoothie right now, oh but it's just goodness. like still not there. Body yeah. B, ladies and gentlemen. Can we get into the record again one more time? Please. Let's play oh bongos. yeah, yeah, yeah. Bongos. Please. I respect it. You sat here for a whole hour and had this shit. I respect you that, sure body. Did.
An hour has passed. How long it been? About 45 it's minutes. Like 45 minutes. minutes. No, 45 minutes. No way. Minutes. It's not like 15 minutes. minutes. 45, 45 minutes. 45 minutes. You know, the, the first time Barty came up here, she wanted McDonald's. I Second time, that. she wanted a bacon, egg, and cheese. Oh, my gosh. I can't even, even think what, about that right what now. What you want Maybe today? it's a sign that you about huh? to shit on what these bitches. You, <laughs> <laughs> you about to shit on them again, Barty. I, I, I want to shit right now. Where's that Barty go, y'all? Oh, yeah, Ladies and gentlemen, Cardi B, the record, let's get in the bongos right now. It's featuring Megan Thee Stallion, and we love you, Barty. I love you. I love you, Man, somebody find body She's a so toilet. Stressed out. Out. <laughs> like, she stressed It's the out. Breakfast Club. It's Cardi B. Wake that ass up early in the morning. The Breakfast Club.